Hello everyone. Welcome to my imperfect art number 23. So, how are we all doing? Valentine's Day is upon us. So, as you can see, I have done a very simple Valentine's Day card idea with a teddy bear carrying a huge bouquet of roses. First, I'll do a pencil sketch and then I will watercolor on it. save you from the pain of seeing me make mistakes and erase and do it all over again i'm just going to fast forward this portion i'm trying to do tilted head for the bear it just looks really endearing Okay, so while I finish this sketch, I was thinking of having a quick chat with you. In the event of Valentine's Day, I was wondering how everyone is going to be celebrating love. Some of us maybe will have a quiet dinner with our loved one. Some of us maybe will have a party time with our friends. Or some of us will spend some treasured time with our parents or close relatives. There will also be a group of people who will celebrate by devoting their time to the less fortunate. And then there will be a percentage of people who will be alone. But being alone is not being lonely. One can have the best of times with themselves and enjoy their own company as much as they do with others or sometimes even more. Nothing should stop anyone. from celebrating themselves on this valentine's day or any other day of the year what do you think let me know okay so for these roses i am doing pencil outline then i will be loosely watercoloring on them we'll do around 40 roses 40 to 45 so find that happy place and keep working on your roses As you can see I'm just doing the outlines of these roses just filling out the gaps trying to make it look like a thick bouquet and I'll speed up the video for you now because it's quite repetitive just filling out the gaps Okay so the pencil sketch is done now I'm not sure if you can see because it's very light. Let me bring it a little closer to the camera. Time for watercoloring now. I can't wait to use my new neon collection for the very first time. I'll just loosely color the roses with my neon paint and a little bit of metallic paint and also normal base watercolor paint. There will be a lot of trial and error now but hopefully I'll find the right color. I am trying the outlines with a glitter pen now but then I'll try a few different pens before finding the right ink for the rose outlines. So no, I don't think the black or the pink glitter pen are right. So I will try a neon ink for the outline now. And I think I quite like it. So good news, I think we have found our colors. So I am using pink neon watercolor, pink metallic watercolor, a little bit of gold watercolor. and to outline i'm using the pink neon pen 
so we have about 40 to 45 roses to work on so find that happy place and keep working on your roses So because it's quite repetitive, so I will fast forward this video for some time while I work away on my roses. And not to forget the little fallen one here. Okay, so I will work on the leaves now and the long stems. Once it has dried, now I will complete the outlines again with my pink neon pen. Okay, so now that the bouquet is done, I will be working on my teddy bear for the next few minutes.
I am using black ink to do the eyes and using the same to do the borders. That is going to make the teddy bear look so prominent. Just doing a little bit of patches here and there. Again, because this is quite repetitive, so I will fast forward the process. Okay, so I have zoomed in a little bit. I have finished doing the black outline and now with the help of a pencil, I'm just doing some furry texture. And now it's time for doing some color sprinkling. Just the final touch on the bouquet. And we are done with the cute little Valentine's Day card. Thank you very much for watching my video so patiently. And I wish you all a very happy Valentine's Day. No matter wherever you are in the world, don't forget to be happy. So friends, if you have enjoyed watching this video, I will very much appreciate a like, comment, share or even subscription. It really helps the channel and keeps me inspired. Thanks again. Take care. And I'll see you in my next video.